was in I was in Alberta uh, for a couple reasons, but I was in this weekend for the Calgary Stampede. So I, want, right to I want to show you my equipment. Hold on a second. <laughs> my stampede. Oops, my belt just came off. Okay, well it just came off. <laughs> Belt's too big for that's your the switches. buckle. That's the problem. That's my my Calgary Stampede buckle. Now it's not the only reason to be in Alberta, by the way. This is it really looks great with the three kind of embarrassing. Why don't you just take this thing off? <laughs> You're to change the rating right. of this show. It's a bit of a problem. Somebody. Let me give you the belt buckle. Probably looks better than Pete anyway. All right, let me tell you what the news is here. In Alberta, uh, they have the largest reserves of oil in the entire world. Now, that's something we've been looking at because, as you can see, probably right here in the bottom of your screen, we have a new record for gas prices, $4.11. Anything happening there? No, nothing. No, that's you. All right. Well, theoretically, you'd see a little thing in the right, bottom right corner of your screen, $4.11 for a is. gallon of gasoline. There we go. $4.11. Uh, oil hit $145.29. That's where it settled on Friday. It actually went higher than that. So we are on an energy hunt and we are looking for oil wherever it may be or energy wherever it may be. May be. And our first trip took us to Fort McMurray in northern Alberta where they have the oil sands where there's oil right in the sand. Take a look. All right, this is it. This is what we came here for. This is oil sand. It's sand that's encased in water and oil. In fact, this is about 10% real crude oil. Taking advantage of this boom? We're going to lose uh, certain things, you know, our traditional lifestyle will erode. I come here and every teacher that ever told me, well, oh, you, do, you don't do good in school, you're never going to make it. I'm making triple what they make. So there are a lot of stories up there. One is that there's oil right in the ground. Two is that it's doing something to the land. We're going to talk about that and the environmental impact. And three, uh, you can go up to Fort McMurray, Alberta, and get a job in whatever you want. We saw signs for 13 and a half bucks at uh, A and W, and and uh, we know McDonald's and all those places are paying. Plus, these oil workers make 100, 120 thousand dollars a year to start because there's so much work up there. For for the next three days, I'm going to be bringing you this uh, edition of uh, of our energy hunt. We're going to be in Fort McMurray, Alberta, and I'll be showing you. Uh, uh, that story all this week on American Morning and on issue number one. Just be sure if you go out there for a job, you bring your insect repellent, right? I, I'm just, I'm still healing from the, <laughs> from the bites. Yeah, black flies the size of moose up there. Yeah, yeah you're making a hundred grand a year. You can afford some. You can buy heat. some. Yeah. <laughs> My, our producer, by the way, brought some kind of very, like no kill, doesn't hurt the environment kind of mosquito repellent. Worked well for you. Didn't work. Didn't yeah. Kill the mosquitoes. Yeah. Oh, thanks.